Well, now it's time for your Movie Review Mondays with our very own Matt Pirin. Welcome to another Monday. There were four major releases this weekend, and no surprise to anyone, Boo 2, a Medea Halloween, took the top spot. But no promise of love or happiness could have sent me to see that one after the first one. The other three films failed to impress in the money department, but the movie I chose looked to be a thriller with a ton of promise. Shortly before I went, though, articles started pouring out about how bad it was. So I was a little jaded going in, but curious to see if it was as bad as people claimed. So without any further ado, here's my take on The Snowman. Our film begins with Harry Hole, played by Michael Fassbender. He's a famous Norwegian detective who has solved some major crimes, but has fallen on some unknown hard times. Seeking solace in the bottle, Harry needs a case to get his life back on track. Suddenly, he receives a taunting note at the same time he meets a promising young recruit and the two are sent out on a missing persons case. A young mother has disappeared and although at first skeptical, it becomes clear to Harry that this case may be linked to cases from years prior and it looks like he has a serial killer on his hands. With more investigation comes more suspects and more backstory and back murders. Plus, the killer just keeps taunting Harry, calling in crimes before he's committed them and leaving snowmen made up of his dismembered victims. Time is of the essence, as the killer seems to always be one up on Harry and his unit, giving them all the clues they need, but still easily being able to avoid being thwarted. As the movie progresses, the events of the past become more and more important as they provide a conclusive link to the events of the present. Harry becomes more and more suspicious of who he can trust, and despite his progress, more victims continue to appear. With options running out, the unit has to come up with some more discreet ways of catching their killer. With everything in turmoil around him, Harry must manage to hold it together because at every minute the killer is looking over his shoulder. We as the audience wait with bated breath to see exactly how this is going to turn out. We may have our own ideas about who the killer is, but we are hoping Harry can figure it out before it's too late. So, what to say about this one? I think this was the most disappointing of all the movies I have seen this year. I'm not saying that because I expected one thing and got another. I'm saying it because all of the ingredients were there for this to be a really good thriller. With Michael Fassbender, J.K. Simmons, Val Kilmer, and others, the cast was solid. The plot is solid. Martin Scorsese even had a hand in the producing of the film. It was all there, but it just never came together. The director himself came out and said he didn't make a very good movie. It was rushed through to production. Some of the script wasn't even filmed, and it shows in the movie. As you're watching it, plot points come up and then are never talked about again, or never resolved. Just watching the trailers while writing this review, there are scenes in them that got cut from the final movie, which would have added more clarity. And this is what upsets me, because it's still an entertaining movie, but I really want to see the movie that would have been. I feel like I've been cheated and that's never how you want to feel leaving the theater. The movie definitely gives you chills and although some of them arise from the plot, most of them come from watching the movie which actually makes you feel cold in the snowy landscapes. Couldn't have been a fun one to film. So I'll tell you what, the movie is worth seeing but I think only so when it comes out on Blu-ray and you're able to see all the deleted scenes that regardless of runtime should not have been deleted. This has been your Monday Movie Musing. Back to you. <laughs> All right, thanks, Matt. We'll be right back after the break with a final look at your forecast. Stay with